Uh, we make it back out into the streets. It is still if you're not. Sorry, it's, like, <laughs> it's automatic. No, no, that's the best music. Uh, we make it back into the streets. Uh, it is it is still hell on earth. There's fires. There's people running and screaming and crying. There's there's huts running around. Um, you can you can even see people uh, right like looting. You can see uh, people attacking other people that are not even husks. The place has just gone to hell. Anarchy is reign supreme. Uh, we make it back to the uh, tavern, and um, there's armed guards at the door. Let us through, and uh, we get in there, and we find Jedediah. Jedediah is busy at the table. Uh, before we all get close to Jedediah, Riordan turns to everybody, and it's just like, guys, yeah, Sharners are home. The government, they're not going to help Sharn. They're not going to help these people. They already, they already did a quarantine. They already closed it off. They already cut their losses. With the sky fall, falling, with the city in near ruins, they can't devote the manpower to to save people here. And, you know, I was, I was even a part of that quarantine. There are hundreds of thousands even with the sky falling, there are hundreds of thousands of civilians still alive in this city. Between the husks and the sky, I mean, this the city is just so populated. It's alive still. There are people out there, and they need help. I mean, we can we can run, we can leave the city, but my parents are out there. This Sean's my home. I've never left. I've I've never been outside of this city, unless you include the you know the underground outside of it. Like that's that's as far away as I've gone. Side note, side note. Uh, Caliban has after after promising to meet you guys at the tavern, is he has already gone. That's why he's not on map. He's already gone back to the orphanage to find out what happened. Um, shock. Uh, before you before you go, Riordan asks you to to stay for a little bit. You can do that. Magic. <laughs> yeah. Magic. Hi. Uh, Chuck Chuck was pounds, saying... He pounds his fist on the table and says, I still have dibs on the dragons. Uh, yes, Chuck. And I'm sure if we stay, we'll have to deal with that eventually. But guys, I'm, I'm going to be real. That was a rumor. And... Alatar, you're not going to want to hear this. But we can't take the city back without Jedediah. Even though his criminal network is a little hurting at the moment, he's still the city's best shot. If, if Simon... Simon... Simon if Simon was still alive, I would disagree with you. But without if him... still alive... I would agree with that. I, I would trust Simon, Simon over Jedediah, but Jedediah's got the connections. He has people. He has he has a small army at his disposal. He he has the resources. The problem is, is he's trying to cut and leave. So what are you trying to say? I'm saying we need to give him a reason to stay. Tell him he can be the new king. That would actually work. Okay, well, I've, I've I've been I've been working with him. This is one thing that this man loves most in the world. It's it's power. Dang, I thought you were gonna say women. Yeah, it's a close second. Uh, he likes powerful women. Whoa, Ron Swanson. I, you know, you know that I don't like this. But I love this city more than I hate Jedediah. And I love this city more than anybody but you guys. All right. So at least between me and Riordan and I think Ren, it's agreed that we need to get Jedediah on our side. What about the rest of you? Chuck, what do you love? <laughs> I have three great loves. 
The woman of my dreams whom I haven't met yet. My shield. And my lucky underwear that appeased the dice gods. <laughs> okay, to be clear, I'm never touching your shield again. Hey, Caliban, what do you love? <laughs> I don't think it's important about what we love. I think it's... I thought that's what we were doing. Are we, are we in? Are we Chuck, in or out? Chuck shrugs and says, if it's going to save innocent lives, then... Like, if, if it would save innocent lives, I would ally with the Nine Hells. Like, we need to save the city. Question... Am I going to have to be in jail again? There is no jail. Okay, yeah, I'm again? in. I'm in. <laughs> uh, hey, hey. Don't okay. ask questions. I'm in. Uh, Caliban is, uh, Caliban is uh, same stance as Alatar. He doesn't like it, but he, we, we need power. And we need, uh, yeah, we just need, we need power right now. May? I mean, after this is all over, I don't want to be... I don't want to have walked around with all this guilt of not helping, so I'm in. All right, uh, let's. I I don't want to make this weird or anything, guys, but we put Jedi on our side. He's our ally, but he is not our friend. I, I want I want you guys to know that. I've worked with him a long time. He he'll have your back when he needs to, but if it's convenient, we're on our own. And I, I just need you guys to know my loyalties are with you. So it's us and against the world or the city. Uh, well, that's all I needed to hear. From from the back of the tavern, you hear a very wet, very prolonged rush. No! Uh, <laughs> no! <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> no. um, Play that Jack music. runs over to Beastie and uh, grabs the magic bag that he passed out. <laughs> okay, well, it's disgusting, but uh, someone can make uh, any kind of check they want to on it. Poop check. <laughs> it's covered in crap. Next. Um, let's see. Sonya does a nature check. For 27. <laughs> to see that beastie's uh, really good. She could tell that there is some kind of natural thing inside the bag. It's, it's, it, the, the bag, it almost seems like a bag of sand. But whatever is inside of it, uh, it's giving off uh, some kind of nature vibes. I would say a smell, but it's covered in crap, so. <laughs> so, uh, sh which one is better for it? Perception or insight? <laughs> no, you, uh, don't to, you don't want to insight too much into that crap. <laughs> I'll tell you what, I'll save, I'll save us some time. Uh, I'm going to make an arcana check for you. I hope you get a one. That's the arcana. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't, I, don't, I don't know what it is. Help me. <laughs> you rolled a 25. I rolled a, a one. Oh, okay. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, all right. That, that, that scared me. Oh. <laughs> all right. Um, I can tell that uh, the content of the bag are natural, but the bag itself is magical. Um, and for whatever reason, we can't open the bag. Yeah, that's a good thing. No poops in there, man. <laughs> yeah, so the bag cannot be opened right now. It's a zip That's all that there is to it. All right. So uh, there are some hurried uh, bard maids that are uh, rushing over to um, to clean up the mess of Beastie. And um, <laughs> Riordan is moving over to talk to Jedediah. Uh, he asks for uh, Alatar to come with him. Uh, anyone else is welcome to come. and Or you guys can eavesdrop. But uh, Riordan only asks for Alatar to come help him talk. I'm going to eavesdrop right here. Okay. Uh, Jedediah. <clears throat> uh, Riordan, hi. You're back. Simon's dead. <sighs> well, he was definitely a good asset, but... Asset? He saved your asset more times than you can count. 
And yes, that was worth it while he was around, but no use dwelling on the past now, is there? Now, I I need to get out of this city. I waited no. I waited too long as it No. 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 You're you're you were telling me no, I pay you. No, no, you no, 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 no. You don't need to go because you need to stay. There are dragons on the loose. There is it, it is hell out those doors. I'm barely holding my assets that I still have together. What has been the one thing, the one main thing that has stopped you at any moment in time from getting more of your precious assets, more money, more connections, more power? What has stopped you? Order. Order has stopped you. Law has stopped you. Reason has stopped you. None of that is here. Listen, I'm going to be honest. I'm here to save the city. But the city is ripe for the picking. There is more for you to gain in staying than there is in leaving. The risk is greater, yes, but with great risk comes great reward. There is no government. There is no king. There is no army. Right now, as far as we know, you're the greatest force here. You you know I'm no fool. And I'm... I know that you don't like me. I know you don't approve of my methods. That's why I only sent you on certain assignments. So I know you asking me to do this, you're not doing a favor for me. No, but I'm doing a favor for me. I can't take this city back. Not without you. So I'm here to save people, and if me saving people, restoring the city... Gets, gets you, you more power, power whatever. whatever. It's, it's worth, worth the cost. cost. You, you know, know my heart. heart. I would love to disagree with you, but I th- I might have to concede. You know, now that I think about it, the it'd be really easy to plant my people everywhere to gain the trust of everyone who's left. I mean, who would? There is no one to stop me. Of course, I would have you know you and your motley little crew, and I can I can send you on assignments as I need to. As, as long, long as it long betters, betters the city, the city we're, on we're on board. We'll see about that. Do we have a okay? Yes. yes, yes, we do. All right. All right. So, what's the next step? All right, I need you to give me give me, give me several hours. I've been I've been packing up. I need to unpack. Um, I've got to get my bodyguard back here, and me, him, and I've I've got a good friend. We 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 need to talk. We need to make some plans. Um, if we're gonna start taking out the city, it's 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 gonna be today. So we're gonna get back together in several hours. You you see me three hours from now. Yes, sir. And with that, Jedediah uh, heads back to the office, and we are left in the tavern. Uh, and that concludes game for tonight. Uh, at the beginning of the next encounter, you can speak with the quartermaster to um, get some supplies. Um, <clears throat> so, just to clarify for the for the players and for any people still viewing. Um, at this point, we have now set the stage. There's an end goal in mind. Our party wants to save the city. We want to save the people. And the only, the best way we have right now is through essentially a criminal mastermind, Jedediah Stone. Uh, as far as for what you guys, the audience, and, and all the characters save Alatar and Jordan, you don't know a whole lot about him other than that he's generally a pretty selfish person. But if he gains from it, he'll take it. Um, so uh, the campaign for, at this point now is to try and save the city. Next week, we will find out um, some battle strategy, some battle plans or strategy, some missions, some ideas that uh, Jedi has to help save the city that will kind of help set, set the tone for what we're going to do within the city. The city is still on quarantine and still on lockdown. Anybody who tries to leave the city at this point is immediately shot down 
the army uh, can spare a lot of forces, but they spared enough to cover all the exits. Um, and due to the widespread sickness uh, that is still in the city, because people can still get sick in the city right now, nobody is allowed to leave. Um, there is there is one way out that Jedediah has. However, it's a small window that might not be open all the time. And it's not a literal window, just to clarify. Uh, so, uh, Brian, is there anything else you need to add? Everyone leveled up? Yes, everyone's going to gain one level. Um, Essentially, there's... I gained a level from running away. Yeah, good job. Yep. Yeah, everyone will be level four at the start of next mission. Uh, no, you did not get any gold this time. Uh, we were not paid for anything that we did today. Technically, I got gold. You got two gold, right? Congratulations. Yeah. Two more than anyone else. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right. Um, yeah, and again, 15 minutes before next time. Yeah, 545 for sound check. That doesn't uh, need to be viewers, told group. <laughs> yeah, sorry, view, viewers, just show up at 6. Yep, show up at 6, and we will be starting next time. Actually, hold on. Well, anyway, we'll let you know if uh, if it still works on the Twitters. Uh, thank you, everyone. Can we get that fun, like, tavern music while we close out? I got you. Oh, nice. Nice. I got you. Nice. Can we play the demon noises instead? I enjoyed that more. Yeah. Anyway. Ooh, I've got a... Uh, can we do both? We, we, can play, we can play Ren's theme music. Oh, yeah. Play, play Ren's music. Oh, gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I recognize this song. Hold on, what's this? Yeah, of course you recognize it. It's your theme music. (laughs) Hey, it's me, Ren. (laughs) What up, everybody? (laughs) Anyway, thank you, everyone, that uh, tuned out uh, for the live show or is watching this on YouTube. Uh, We will be back next week um, for the next mission. And, uh, yeah, we hope to see you all there. I'm trying to think if there's anything else. Like and subscribe. It is D-Pain. Oh, yeah. For oh, more of such videos. I always forget about that. I haven't done YouTube in so long. <laughs> yeah. We appreciate um, likes and subscribes. Yeah. Leave a comment below if you think there's anything we can approve on. Yeah. Smash um, that like button. Smash it. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't, you're fat. Fat. <laughs> okay, yeah. All that. Do all that and more. Uh, we'll try to keep getting some information out to you guys. Uh... I guess the best instant contact way of doing this is uh, looking at my Twitter, because I'll make sure we update that. Well, at least I'll update it to let you guys know what's happening. And uh, this music is rocking. Uh, yeah, so I think that, <laughs> that is it. So, until next time, we'll talk to you all later. See ya! See ya!